I would like to present a very, very famous radio receiver made by ICOM, the R9000. This radio was made on the 90s and uh, it's a huge radio, about 20 kilos. This radio was uh, very well appreciated by the professional and also by the amateur radio. This radio was famous mainly because the, the, the scope in the middle of uh, the radio, the scope uh, was very useful. For example, as you can see here, to select memory channel, you can have up to 1000 memory channel to access to many different kind of uh, settings. To uh, set, set up the scan mode, start stop, you can scan frequency or channel, quite uh, normal for any scanner. And the, the most famous option was the scope. Here. Here you can see the scope. If I go for example on FM band, You can see the, the signal here in the middle of the, the radio station. I am now 100 kilohertz wide. If I go down to 50, it gets wider and even 25 kilohertz, even more wider. If I go on shortwave now, let's try this way. I put SSB one hundred kilohertz wide I can see the activity around my frequency here. Let's go on amateur radio band, 20 meters, SSB, I take out the squelch. I go narrow with the scope. India with Alpha Quebec Radio. Au sud de l'Italie, appel repasse le coude. Transmettez s'il vous plaît. I can uh, I can go also uh, for a short wave radio. Let's put AM. In that case, I will change the the speed of the VFO. I go faster. One kilohertz, five kilohertz, and there is a switch inside of uh, the VFO. And now I go with five kilohertz step. Let's go back on air traffic. Squelch. The radio comes with a very nice speaker, the SP20. 
and all together this make a very nice radio set.